crowds eagerly waited outside Winchester Discovery Centre for the arrival of X Factor finalist Ruth Lorenzo, making an appearance for the launch of the Winchester Jewellers 2009 range. On Ruth's arrival, she was greeted with hordes of screams from the excited fans. It was a private event, but we were able to bring you exclusive footage and interviews from inside. Organiser of the event, Jake Sanders, tells us more. Jake, why is it that you picked Ruth for your launch? She is the perfect role model for Joy. She relates to the person that buys the jewellery. She relates to the style of the jewellery. She's just very, she's a very wo womanly figure and she was the most womanly figure in the X Factor this year. Okay, how did uh, you get involved with X Factor? Did they approach you or did you approach them? It's a funny story actually. Um, I live on the same road as the X Factor house. So it actually turned out that I bumped into Alexandra and Laura when I was walking home from the tube station up in London. Um, and I was just chatting to them and obviously I've always got joy in the back of my mind so obviously it came up in conversation and I just sort of gave them a few pieces to wear at their leisure. Um, they then passed those pieces on to the stylist of the X Factor and she contacted me. Um, and then from there we just sort of rolled with it because we're a bespoke jewellers we can make whatever Yeah, I heard she you wants. made um, JLS and like dog tags. Have JLS you had any other celebrities wear your, your design? Um, we've had Girls Aloud and Cheryl Cole wearing the the Joya Swarovski stars. Um, they were given those a year and a half ago at one of their concerts down in Bournemouth. Um, Alicia Dixon's bought jewellery from us at an auction. We've got obviously footballers being Wayne Rooney and Matt Letizia and his wife. And now we bring you our highly anticipated interview with Ruth. Hey, hi Ruth, thanks for meeting with us. Oh, thank you yeah, for you receiving me. You must really cold all the autographs that you signed as you came in. It was very nice. Yeah. I can't believe they're all really cheery yeah, and very exciting. Yeah, the reception was really great, wasn't yeah. it? How are you liking Winchester at the Well, moment? it's amazing. I did not know people were so welcoming here. It's, I felt really, really good. Really oh. good. And about the Joya jewellery, what is it that appeals to you about them? Well, um, I met them through JLS that had some of their necklaces and I wore some of their I've stuff. I've seen you wore one of the yeah. JLS don't tell yeah. yeah, yeah, because I'm rooting for them, you know, for yeah, JLS and Alex. Well, I want Alex to win, yeah. but I thought JLS needed a bit of help. Yeah, well, so they've made it into the final now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's great. What's next for you? What do you think you're going to go um, on to? Well, I have the tour to do with the X Factor. I'm, I'm gigging all around the country and doing many photo shoots and things and parties like this and meeting new people. Um, I believe there is contracts to be looked at, but we can't do anything until the, um, the tour is over. So. Oh, okay. so how does it feel having a necklace made especially for you? It is amazing. I, do, I can't believe it. It's, it's actually very beautiful and it's something like I would have not design it better than this you know it's like she was in my mind yeah, when she did this it was amazing it's beautiful okay and did you ever find out if simon ever give you his phone number as he always no. said no. <laughs> no he hasn't given me his oh. telephone number not yet after a busy and successful evening for tonight at least winchester can definitely say it's had a bit of the x factor